I have with me IIT Delhi professor Dr Jagdish Telang Rao Sahu uh, who is a well known tunnel expert and is also a member of a high level government committee which has been set up to study and recommend norms for tunnel design and maintenance Professor Jagdish the first question is that lots of questions have arisen uh, about the context in which the crisis the tunnel crisis happened as an expert how do you see this all these questions that have emerged uh i think uh, there are many aspects of this uh why it has happened i think committee has formed and at what stage the mistake has happened or was it uh, uh, unavoidable that has to be ascertained it could be uh, Uh, deficient side investigation it could be defects in the uh, design it could be uh, it could be uh, construction defect or it could be just a freak accident inside mm. the tunnel mm. we have to investigate this and mm. have to find this there are around 100 projects which are in the pipeline in different stages uh, some tunnels have been designed in some cases the construction work has started uh, nhai as we know has already ordered an audit of 29 tunnels which are under construction now delhi metro rail corporation officials will be helping them konkan railway also they have an mou with them so a rethinking is now in place whether the systems and the uh, protocol through which we have been digging tunnels whether they are apt or whether we need to you know further strengthen them uh how important is this and do you think that in the context uh it will be very important now to see what nhai audit actually finds in about uh, other tunnels uh, uh there are uh, i think our uh, codes codal provisions are not so uh, so developed at the moment mm. because the tunneling is a kind of a in india to this uh, this extent has been uh, after in last 15 20 years has gone like uh, uh, to this extent hmm. earlier it was uh, there but mostly it was confined to hydro power hmm. but now it, it has come to railways it has been extended to highways etc and uh, unlike the hard rock in abs or in south india himalaya is a kind of a a uh, consolidated sediment where the tunneling is a is treacherous so mm. if you do the tunneling in the himalayan region then you have you need to have the side investigation the himalayan rocks also they change uh, in few hundred meters they can change so mm. you have to have proper side investigation before uh, carrying out the tunneling but in addition to that also you should be having a feedback mechanism because all the uncertainties you will not come to know as soon as you start digging the tunnel but as you progress then you start realizing which kind of rock you have got as you as the rocks are exposed so you need to develop a feedback mechanism so that you if at some places you find that the rocks are are weak in some places you find that uh, rocks are not good then you can or some water is seeping through mm. then you should be having the feedback mechanism you can strengthen your support system you can take the measure to prevent the rock ro uh, flow of water mm. inside the tunnel so all these things can be done as you progress so there has to be a feedback mechanism mm. and beside that the safety aspects should be taken care of mm. this is very important for our viewers if in simple words you can explain you said that there is a need to strengthen the side investigation uh, systems and mechanism uh, what is side investigation essentially a uh, side investigation means uh, at any place if you are going to dig a dig inside the mountain so you need to find out which kind of rock it has hmm. you have to find out whether there are faults or folds what kind of stresses are present is there any perch water table or aquifer through which the water can flow through the tunnel because tunnel acts like a like a uh, channel through which the mm. ground water can just flow like a river 
Mm. You do not know. So you have to prevent all this happening and this can cause uh, and also there if suppose some uh, uh, weak rocks are there mm. around the tunnel and then th that those things can cause the mishap. So one need to strengthen their uh, uh, side investigation uh, for safety purposes. One last question. Uh, was there an escape channel? Uh, tunnel in this uh, case the cry where the crisis happened and do you think that the idea of a of an escape tunnel is something that should be weaved in how we design our tunnels in future yes yes that is very important that all the uh, safety aspect of uh, not only the workers constructing the tunnel but also the people using the tunnel should be provide uh, should be adequately taken care of right. that is very important thing right. thank you very much for talking to ndtv so in iit delhi with my, my camera colleague himanshu shekhar ndtv india